And a Central Florida doctor remains in business despite accusations that he has misdiagnosed at least two of his patients. Now two women have sued the neurologist saying he treated them for multiple sclerosis, but those patients later learned they didn't have the disease. News 6 investigator Mike DeForest is live outside the neurologist's office in Palm Bay. Mike, this doctor is still allowed to practice? Uh, neurologist Gary Weiss has been practicing medicine uh, here in Florida since the early 1980s here at his clinic in Palm Bay as well as in Vail, Colorado. Now he does have an active Florida medical license. As for his medical license in Colorado, well, that's a different story. According to his office website, Dr. Gary Weiss has had a long and distinguished career practicing neurology. But last week, two of Weiss's former patients in Colorado filed lawsuits. They claim the doctor misdiagnosed them with multiple sclerosis. One patient claims Weiss treated her for five years, prescribing medication that caused full body pain, which led to depression, sleeplessness, and marital problems. Another patient says she underwent seven years of painful MS treatment at Dr. Weiss office. Yet when those women later visited other doctors, they learned they did not have MS, according to the lawsuits. This is a uh, really sad example, tragic example of a healthcare provider putting profits over patients without any checks or oversights. Back in 2012, the Colorado Medical Board launched an investigation into Dr. Weiss after another patient claimed the neurologist failed to diagnose a brain lesion. But before the medical board could determine whether or not Dr. Weiss's conduct was unprofessional, the two sides entered into a settlement. Weiss agreed he would not renew his Colorado medical license and promised to never practice in that state again. When I stopped by Dr. Weiss's Palm Bay office, an employee told me he was out of the country and had not received my multiple phone calls seeking comment. Weiss's Florida medical license remains clear and active and shows no disciplinary action taken here. Uh, just about 15 minutes ago, Dr. Weiss actually emailed me a statement. In part, he says there is absolutely no basis for these allegations. Now, the Florida Department of Health says, in general, any complaints filed against doctors would be confidential unless the agency finds probable cause that a violation may have occurred. Uh, that has not been the case when it comes to Dr. Weiss, but that also means that his Florida patients here in Palm Bay uh, don't have any real easy way of learning about his history unless they actively seek out uh, those medical records in Colorado. Matt and Lisa. Mike, let's talk about those Florida patients for a second. Have any of Weiss's patients from this state had complaints about him? Uh, we, we could only find one. It was about two years ago. A Brevard County man sued him for malpractice. It wasn't an MS case. He claimed uh, that the doctor misread an MRA and that led to an aneurysm. It was just last year the doctor settled that lawsuit with the patient. All right, Mike DeForest live for us in Palm Bay. Thank you.